Hi, I'm Nick. I'm uh, CEO of First Light Fusion, uh, and our mission is to solve the problem of fusion power with the simplest machine possible. And simplicity is a thread which runs through all of our technology. Uh, our power plant concepts is dramatically simpler. It can be built with existing technology, existing materials, existing supply chains. We, we neatly sidestep all of the, or some of the big uh, known engineering issues of, of fusion power. It also comes into the, the nature of the, the core technology as well. So we're working on a, a new method for inertial fusion, which we call projectile fusion. We fire a high velocity projectile, it flies for a short distance and it hits into a target and the target contains the, the fusion fuel. Um, the machine which launches the projectile is a lot simpler than what the, the mainstream of inertial fusion is proposing, which is a laser. It's much cheaper. And then the last piece of simplicity is Actually, when the projectile hits the target, the physics that happens there and the physics that takes place inside the target, that's simpler too. And that gives us a really crucial advantage, which is our process can be simulated and can be simulated accurately. That means we learn much faster in the simulations in silico than you ever would with physical experiments. Although, of course, the ultimate question is, are the simulations right? So working towards showing fusion, that's the mission now, uh, but we actually raised some more money at the start of this year, uh, $45 million. That's actually to, to get ahead and to start on the next phase, which is building a new experiment, bigger, designed to show more energy out than in for the first time. So we're already progressing into that next phase of demonstrating energy gain. And that is the, the, the crucial um, uh, physics demonstration that's needed but it's not the only activity that we're going to be starting in that next phase. Uh, we're actually going to be really broadening out the work we're doing on the plant engineering. And the, the goal of the next phase is, is actually to get to a de-risk design for a power plant. And that, that includes the gain experiment as the single biggest, most important thing. But it, there's lots of other detail which, which we'll be working through. And what that means is that the commercial opportunity for First Light starts at the end of that phase it, it doesn't start you know you don't have to wait all the all the way until a power plant is operating before we start to have a commercial opportunity uh, and potentially revenue opportunity in terms of our business model uh, there's a lot of optionality but the 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 nature of the technology um, gives us an option which well no one else in fusion really has which is there's a consumable item which is uh, this target and it's uh, it's uh, incredibly difficult to make and it's even more difficult to understand and, and design. And it, it's a very protectable piece of intellectual property or everything that goes into the target. So uh, we will have a consumables business model available to us where we manufacture and sell these targets to the operators of the power plant. So we provide the fuel which goes into the power plant. And just to give you a sense of the value of each one of those targets, uh, one of our targets uh, would be able to produce enough energy to power the average UK home for over two years, just from one target. And we will hopefully be selling millions and millions of these. 